definitely have to focus on this man. Well, Derek, we know he can score goals in many different ways, but I think he's at his most dangerous when he's running with the ball and hitting his shots with power. It's almost unstoppable for the goalkeeper. That's what makes him a great finisher. It is Juventus. They take on Real Madrid, and it's coming up next on EA TV. Nights like these are just what you hope for as a spectator. A warm welcome. I'm Derek Ray, positioned here on the commentary gantry, and alongside me at the microphone is Stuart Robson. And with the game just moments away now, this really ought to be a superb watch. It's Juventus, and they take on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, when looking forward to this game, you can't help but notice there are some great matchups all over the pitch, particularly in those central areas. Whichever team wins more of those battles will win the game. And this is how Juventus will line up. Wojciech Szczesny stands between the posts. Weston McKenney starts alongside Adrian Rabio in the centre of the park. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. And tremendous individual skill. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Ferlon Mendy plays with Carvajal in the fullback positions. And it's two strikers up front who'll look to provide the goal scoring threat. Space galore for Juventus. Well, disappointing end to the move. Rodrigo and threading it through and the keeper stretching to deny him Valverde well body in the way really good build up but no end product saw the situation developing Eduardo Camavinga Rabio Federico Chiesa and they might forge ahead really high class goalkeeping from Courtois and over comes the corner anticipation <laughs> Bellingham Vinicius oh fancy footwork Radio be able to produce from this position good looking sequence and up for grabs off the keeper threat over for now it seems so plenty of forward momentum from Real Madrid here and angling it back very much run of the mill as saves go taking it away Eder Militao Mendy nicely timed tackle Rodrigo Rabio. The ball with Chiesa. Real chance. 
And that's an excellent piece of defending to thwart him. Individual brilliance. Well then there to tidy up. Using space on the opposite flank now. Valverde. Well, a foul, but the advantage was Real Madrid. Camavinga. Rodrigo. And a foul in the opinion of the referee. Now, what can they do from this free kick situation? Just look at this again, because it's a great piece of skill. He uses the outside of his foot to hit it so cleanly. What a fantastic free kick. Locatelli. Rabiot. Has someone to play it to. So a throw in for Real Madrid. Camavinga Vinicius Junior and players waiting in the centre shaping to shoot and gobbled up with ease by the keeper so half time it is the end of the first half here in Turin This man will get most of the plaudits for his contribution up to this point, Stuart. Well, I thought he had a really effective first half. Not only did he get the goal that gave them the lead, but his general play was really good. He was a constant threat, and I'm sure we'll see more of him in the second half. Well, it is advantage Real after the first 45 minutes, but there's a long way from being settled. Giving the ball away. Fine goalkeeping to push that away. Well, Real pushing to add to the lead. It's a corner. <laughs> Delivering it. Well, desperately close to going in that time. Danilo. Kostic has it, and very deftly cut out. Might be onto something with that ball. Nice ball to switch the point of attack. And snuffed out the danger immediately. Oh, splendid skill. And he might be through here. And a goal! Well, here we can see it again. Look at the way he glides past the defender to create space for himself. And his movement's so clever. Once he gets onto it, there's only one thought in his head. Smash it as hard as possible. What a good goal. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. That's very effective. Good high pressing. Eduardo Camavinga. Now with Bellingham. And he's broken free. 
And a very good challenge. And in range. A goal here. Giving his team precisely what they were looking for. Now he deserves to celebrate it. Well, I have to say, that's a good finish. He knew exactly what he wanted to do there. He's just passed it into the corner. That's a nice goal. Well read to win possession back. Federico Valverde. 30 minutes to go then. And Real with the ball again. Oh, great vision. McKenny. And Bellingham. And with that, the attack fizzles out. Cambiasso and Juve unable to keep the ball fine work from Juve to win back possession Rabio. On to Chiesa. Twenty minutes remaining. He's given us away. Locatelli. Andrea Cambiasso. Well, tight angle, denied by the woodwork, Stuart. Well, he's virtually on the byline there. It nearly squeezed in, though. Valverde. And now Rodrigo. And there it breaks down, but credit to the defence. Vinicius Junior. Chance to finish. And danger still. On a time for composure on the ball. Weston McKenney. Using the wide route could be beneficial for Juve. Now, who can he pick out? Federico Valverde. Good distribution. Well, Juventus have it back here. Vlaovic. Straight out of play off the keeper's boot. It will be a throw-in. Well, these Juve fans have seen enough. There's no way back for them now. They've been really poor today. Well, you've got to say, comfortably off target, Stuart. Yeah, that's a waste of good possession. His teammates are not happy with him, and they're letting him know. Valverde. Eduardo Camavinga. This looks interesting. Oh, how about that for a tackle? Superbly read and executed. That's a good looking pass. Oh, surely was an important piece of defending. Locatelli. Kostic. And a 
in the perfect position to read it. And there goes the final whistle. It is a victory for them. Is anyone going to be able to stop them? Well, that was a really good display. They controlled the flow of the game. Play like this until the end of the season and they'll surely be promoted. But it just seems of this game, he's been a step ahead of his opponents in every way, Stuart. Well, that was a great performance. His understanding of how to find space was brilliant today. And of course, he scored two really good goals. Promotion beckons, and a draw is all they need. Stay tuned, we'll have all the action for you live from the Bernabeu here on EA TV. Hello from one of the great venues in world football, the Estadio Santiago Bernabeu in Madrid. I'm Derek Ray, ready to bring you match commentary, and alongside me is Stuart Robson. And a huge story unfolding, I say that because they are closing in potentially on promotion. It's Real Madrid facing Manchester City. Cheers, Derek. Well, a point is all they need, and the way they've been playing, you sense it's inevitable. The manager will be urging them to attack the game from the very first minute. You certainly don't want it going into the next match. And here's the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Carvajal starts with Ferlon Mendy in the fullback positions. And the story in attack is one of a strike partnership. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson stands between the posts. Manuel Akanji plays with Kyle Walker as fullbacks. Kevin De Bruyne plays alongside Rodri in the centre of midfield. And it's an interesting looking attacking constellation with three forwards listed from the start. Well, if you're looking for a player to take any game by the scruff of the neck, look no further than Vinicius Junior, top quality. What are you expecting to see from him? Well, Derek, when he's on form, when he's focused, he's a brilliant runner with the ball. He can take on players. He can go past people with ease. And he's got a great shot on him as well. I'm really looking forward to watching him play today. Might be dangerous. <laughs> Aurelien Chouameni is with Vinicius Junior. Well, it looked highly promising, but they got nothing out of it. Valverde. Oh, a vital interception. Vinicius. Oh, a stellar piece of defending. Bellingham. Attacking possibilities for Real. And the flag has gone up, offside. Real Madrid coming away with it. Well, that's common sense refereeing to play advantage. Well, sometimes advantage just doesn't work out. And the referee has awarded a free kick now. Valverde. And possession lost by Real Madrid.
Carvajal. Chouameni. Mendy has it. Said he did well to win it back. Likes to run with the ball at his feet. Stopped a certain goal. Well, real difficulty keeping the ball. Real using width to good effect. It needs an accurate cross. Well, there's an example of how to press high up. And goes for goal! Well, leaning back a bit, couldn't keep the shot down. De Bruyne. Phil Foden now. Superb looking pass. Well, last gasp defending, but brilliant defending. And Bellingham. And the penalty has been given here. This to make it 1-0. Taking aim from the spot and finding the target. Well, here it is again. The keeper tries to read the penalty, but in the end, he just makes no effort whatsoever. That's a strange decision. So City get the match restarted. Can they come up with an equaliser having conceded? Bellingham. Well, the half-time interval is fast approaching. Real Madrid leading. Stuart, your critique of their first half display. Well, it's been a tight game so far, but they've just had that little bit more quality on the ball, particularly in midfield, where they've just started to take control. They'll be fairly happy going in at half-time if it stays like this. Given away by City. De Bruyne. Good distribution. Danger averted for now. Perfect challenge. Oh, that's a really good pass. It could be up for grabs. Well, it comes to nothing in the end. Kamavinga. And Bellingham. Mendy. Well, there's a really stylish piece of running. Vinicius Jr. Oh, surely. Nicely saved. Did well to clear it away. And there it is, the half-time whistle. Second half underway with Real looking to build upon a positive first half showing. And space to attack. Real losing possession.
An inability to keep hold of the ball there. Carvajal. Now with Vinicius Junior. And that's fantastic goalkeeping to get across and deal with the danger. Corner to Real as they try to press home their advantage. Who can they pick out? Oh, tremendous header that time. But the goalkeeper was there. Another corner. And passing it well. Walker failed to hold it. Grealish. And teammates to play it to. Element of risk there, but he's won the ball. No degree of difficulty at all for the keeper. Well, if you don't take your chances and you don't make the most of the dangerous situations, you're going to struggle. And that's been the case for City today. Just oh, wait a minute, Stuart. Opportunity. And under pressure, that was a fine play. A oh, good vision there. Well, the defenders know they need to get tighter. Can't really allow runs like that. Oh, commanding goalkeeping. Rodrigo. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid. Oh, my three. Oh, and it clips the crossbar. Well, it's a good effort, but in the end, not quite good enough. A change in the offing for City. Walker. De Bruyne. And Real doing well to win it back. And Bellingham. Well, they could have been in. But that's wonderful defending. Pressure applied. Diesch. Pressure applied. Can they make something of it? Opportunity it is. We have 20 minutes left in this game. Well, he needed to read it to get there and did. Holland. Courtois. And Bellingham. And full marks for the precision there. Well, the danger is still there. A wonderful intervention. Well, you can tell what the fans think of that decision. They're certain it should have been a penalty. Foden, very quick thinking there, a City free kick forthcoming well one eye on the stopwatch but they are cruising to victory and surely Stuart they can't throw away promotion from here well, they deserve this, don't they, Derek? They've played some great football today, as they have for most of the season. Not long to go now. De Bruyne. 
Well, there to intercept. Decent looking pass. Well, the fans want to see a shot. And a goal! They lead by two now. And that allows them to breathe a bit more easily. Well, he wasn't going to waste this chance. 1v1 against the keeper, and he slots it away with great confidence. That's a good finish. And the ball is moving again. 2-0 is how it stands. Manuel Akanji. Bellingham. And successfully cut out. Rodrigo trying to open them up oh did so well to deny him sloppy Cabajal it is advantage Manchester City here he's got to score looked like a certain goal but that's a great challenge and the referee has added on two minutes of stoppage time. Nice looking pass. Vinicius Junior. And now Rodrigo. And Bellingham. Real chance. And a goal to settle the issue once and for all. This could be a very special day. A draw is all they need to be crown champions. It's Manchester City. They take on Real Madrid, and it's coming up next on EA TV. Hello and welcome to the Etihad Stadium. My name is Derek Ray and I'm joined for commentary by the former Arsenal and West Ham player Stuart Robson. And here's a question before we start. Will this be the day when the title issue is settled? It is Manchester City and they take on Real Madrid. Well, Derek, they've been brilliant all season. So I'm expecting them to go out and win the title here today. And if they do that, they will be deserving winners. They've been so good to watch. What can Real do from this position? A chance to whip it in. Took a really smart piece of defending to stop them. And a look at the starting 11 for Manchester City. Ederson is the goalkeeper. Bernardo Silva plays alongside Kevin De Bruyne in the centre of midfield. And the tactical configuration has two players in attack from the very outset. They're all doing their bit to keep them out. And the starting 11 for Real Madrid. Thibaut Courtois is in goal. Carvajal starts with Ferland Mendy in the fullback positions. And so many different ways to configure an attack. In this case, it'll be two men up front. Kevin De Bruyne. Back with Silva. Can he put them ahead? Oh! title push well they have to settle down here they're rattled that really is a shock to the system well here you can see it again good run great strength and a composed finish under pressure that's a top class goal and snuffed out the danger immediately Alvarez De Bruyne now Nicely cut out. Good ball to switch the play. Carvajal. 
Might work out. Well, there is a very alert goalkeeper for you. Gvardiol. Alvarez. Real Madrid regaining possession. Can they trouble the opposition this time? Well, they've solved the problem for now, but let's see. Oh, he's done it! And we might just have witnessed the goal that secures the title. Well, what a moment that could turn out to be. They've just got to defend well now. So back underway. They've levelled it at 1-1 here. Walker. Here's Kovacic. De Bruyne. Rodri. Given away by City. Gvardiol. On to Holland. Well, there was impending danger, but good defending. Real Madrid have been awarded the free kick. Mateo Kovacic. The switch of play now. How to dispossess your opponent. Real in a good position out wide. Oh, it's a superb challenge. Very timely. Diesch. Another successful intervention, winning the ball back. Carvajal Rodrigo Here's Vinicius Junior Fine tackle there to prevent the chance Vandiol Holland And defensive play to be applauded. Eder Militao. Kamavinga. And taking it away. Walker. Here's Kovacic. City unable to retain possession. Holland. Well, the fans really want him to shoot. Pressing like that will help the cause. Carvajal. Really good build up, but no end product. And so the half time whistle is sounded here in Manchester. Well, as they get the ball rolling again, interesting to see how the second half pans out. Given away by City. 
Carvajal. Vardiol. Holland. Silva. It did look on for them, but not to be. The referee has given the advantage to Real Madrid, using space on the opposite flank now. And really discomfited by the press. Is it going to be? And there it is, a goal! It's just possible that might be the one that wins them the title. Well, look at the celebrations. They certainly believe so. Still a job to do, but surely they won't throw it away from this position. Well, as you can see, this is a wonderful strike. He makes the perfect connection, and he has so much pace on it. It's a great goal. De Bruyne. Akanji has it. Given away by City. You are celebrating the wedding anniversary. Congratulations, Mike and oh, tremendous vision. Poland. De Bruyne now. Mateo Kovacic. And Manchester City moving the ball with purpose. And he read it well. Now, counter-attacking possibilities here. Oh, could be. And still danger here. And you've just witnessed a moment of truly high-class goalkeeping. You're absolutely right. What a save that is. He's reacted so quickly. Carvajal is with Vinicius Junior able to get his body in the way the referee has decided to give the free kick decision the way of City De Bruyne Guardiol and the ball with De Bruyne, and he's making progress. This could be the equaliser. Oh, a goal it is! But no need to panic just yet. Well, that certainly makes it interesting. You can feel the anxiety out there. Bellingham. Eduardo Camavinga. Just cutting off the supply. This might be the perfect counter-attacking opportunity. Holland. Foden. Will he shoot? The fans hope so. De Bruyne takes the shot. Oh, it comes. to nothing in the end really should have made more of that and Manchester City will go to their bench and City get the throw in Rodri Clearly took a touch on the way out of play, so a throw-in to come. Well, we're inside the final quarter of an hour now. Diaz. Stones. Here's Grealish. An effective challenge. Oh, lovely ball. Stones. 
Uh, plays with a positional sense that is second to none. Well, it's a pretty acceptable position to be in, Stuart. Given the time situation, they hold the cards. Well, my advice in these situations is to play the game in the opponent's half. Don't sit back and invite pressure. That's asking for trouble. Not giving him a moment's peace. Well, if they get the winner now, these City fans will go absolutely wild. What an atmosphere we have inside this stadium. Stones. Five minutes of the 90 still to go. And the teams cannot be separated. Well, couldn't bend his run, and the flag went up. Stones attending to his defensive duties. If Real Madrid could come up with a winner at this stage, it could be decisive. Oh, that's a super piece of defending. Under real pressure defensively, will they pay the price? Well, really rifling that one in, and he didn't miss by much. And just one minute of stoppage time, say the officials. Valverde, really fine piece of defending play to break us up. And that will do it. The referee brings this contest to an end, and the title is officially theirs. Well, it was a difficult game today, but they showed great spirit, didn't they? It doesn't come much better than this. Just look at those scenes. And now for the moment of confirmation, the trophy presentation. Well, this is what they were dreaming of before the game. To come and pick this trophy up. What a performance from them. Yes, a performance that has impressed absolutely everyone. And now it comes down to holding that piece of silverware aloft. The sweet taste of success. It has been quite the journey. And it comes to an end in style on the big stage. And now the celebrations can begin. Not just the players, but also the fans, the coaching staff, everybody involved with this club. What a performance it's been. Full marks to the entire team. And now they get the chance to exhale and enjoy. They've been brilliant in this competition, and so have the fans. They've really got behind their team. They've played a big part in this win. Just look at those faces in the crowd. Great stuff. They're really a match made in heaven between players and fans. And these celebrations are going to continue for quite some time. And now the players get to relax a bit and enjoy having the pictures taken. Well, these photos will be cherished for years to come, won't they? Certainly ones to show the grandchildren. Thank you